Welcome to Lady of the Manor Chat Show. How long have you been doing poetry? For about 10 years. That's a long time. And has the mood of your poetry changed over that time? It's maybe got a bit more humorous, maybe got a bit more uh, informed politically. And now I like to write stories. She got her whole arm tattooed. Hello Kitty in colour above her left elbow. Other characters too. Little Mai and Mimble, Winnie the Pooh. Even that one from Dragon Ball Z. I'm pretty sure she doesn't watch Dragon Ball Z, but her brother did, so it must have seeped into her unconscious. This is very mysterious, I find. <laughs> Could you tell me what is going on? <laughs> Sam, could you help me? What do you mean? This fabric matches my paintings. Well, she's right. She's really right, isn't she? Her fabric does match her paintings, and what a beautiful painting that is. What does Material Girl want? Ooh. Okay, the question was, what does Material Girl want? And the answer is... Oh, honestly, control. Good. Uh, it's going to be on this year, the second week in September, on a Sunday. So my part is to make sure that the community gets involved, but also make sure the council has got money for those people to take part. Do you find that um, the carnival is a good way of bringing peace to situations that might be difficult beforehand? Have you experience in working with carnival in that way? Yeah, I've actually experienced that. I think I got invited to go to Bosnia. There were two different facts which were not speaking with each other. So we went there and then we decided that we could use carnival for these people to talk with each other. Within the three months that they were doing it, they started speaking with each other because they wanted to know what the other one is doing, what the other one is doing, sharing material and so on. So that was just an, for me as a good example of how powerful this art form could be used. Could you tell us, Sam, what your poetry book was inspired by? It was inspired by the people of Western Sahara. At the death of General Franco, it was invaded by Morocco. And they fought a war up until 91 when they agreed a ceasefire. So more than half the people in the invasion uh, left the country and they live in refugee camps in Algeria. I would very much like to invite Sam to read us one of the poems. Would that be a possibility? Yes, ladies and gentlemen. Is this poem written by yourself? Yeah, I'm going to do one by myself about meeting a poet there. Wonderful. The billows pump the coal. Frankincense floats lightly through the four-doored tent, open at all sides to chance breezes or wandering strangers. Squares of light across the carpeted floor hint at that glass-topped glare of the engulfing desert that swallows vast swathes of the continent. Thank you very much for coming tonight. Please feel free to chat and mingle. Um, we've got still the work, people to talk to. We'll be settling down and putting things off the walls. But please, thank you so much for coming. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> set up a chat show here in Hackney. If you would like to star on my chat show, doing singing, dancing, telling a story or an experience, 
do not hesitate in being in contact. I would be delighted to meet you. Promote your project and show us your talents. Contact me on Lady of the Manor Facebook page and check me out on YouTube, Lady of the Manor. Ciao for now.